Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. In a recent interview with the Japanese publication The Nikkei, Nintendo's global president Shuntaro Furukawa was asked a series of questions about the global semiconductor shortage and how this would affect Nintendo in the near future. One question that stood out the most from this interview was whether or not Nintendo has any plans of increasing the price of the Switch console due to this semiconductor chip shortage. And here's what Shuntaro Furukawa had to say. We're not considering that at this point for two reasons. In order to offer unique entertainment to a wide range of customers, we want to avoid pricing people out. Our competition is the variety of entertainment in the world and we always think about pricing in terms of the value of the fun we offer. Our products also include software. Nintendo has sold more than 100 million Switch units so far and it's important to maintain the momentum for our overall business. Generally speaking, a weak yen makes domestic Switch sales less profitable. So there you all have it. Just because inflation is sky high right now and gas prices seem to be dipping at this moment in time, but trust me, it'll just be a moment in time. Nintendo has no plans of increasing the price of the Switch consoles and they don't have plans of increasing the price of their games either because that doesn't make sense. Nintendo has seen more profit than they've ever seen in the recent years, so hey, they have to keep the momentum going. And increasing the prices of their products will only hinder their success. Nintendo knows this. And Furukawa also stated that Nintendo will just absorb all of the price hikes that's going on because of the semiconductor chip shortage. So don't worry, no price increases are coming to Nintendo. With that being said, that's going to do it for this video. And what are your thoughts on everything discussed here? Please let me know down in the comment section. And please, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, remember to keep it locked here to around the clock. We're here. We focus on Nintendo news content around the clock. I'll catch you guys in the next one.